important important if you're not going to have a room with two players what you're going to want to do you're going to want to stay as close as you can to uh, other player the important thing is for you to collaborate with other players don't forget about these things the toolbox is really important because it will automatically repair the door with one percent for each second now really important skills over here for the door you're going to have the emergency bell welcome let me check out gray world over here on idol games tv now in this game you're just going to need to survive that's it probably you have played similar games it's not going to be that hard you're going to have different kind of characters over here you're going to be able to level them up but first you're going to need to unlock them with some gemstones that you're going to get by playing in the campaign you're going to be able to have five tickets daily you're going to need to wait until they're gonna refresh let's say this is a good ad for you to watch if you're going to watch this ad this is going to offer you the possibility to get a discount for the table machines the table machines are going to be quite quite useful i'm not going to watch the ad but here is how the game will go depending on the map or depending on the campaign mode you're going to be able to play with other uh, people over here now unfortunately this game is not that active unfortunately so you're going to need to wait a bit until it's going to be let's say more well known now this is what you're going to need to do, you're going to need to upgrade your door and you're going to be able to put different kind of spoon towers at first. You're going to be able to level these things up, you're going to be able to unlock different kind of things and you're going to be able to survive. You're going to need at least in this map to survive at least 6 minutes. But if you're going to kill everyone that's against you, this is how you're also going to be able to win, okay? so put all the tables over here in order for you to level them up afterwards the good idea is that at least in this map you're going to be able to stay in the same room with another player so you will be able to have more spoon tables in order for you to uh, let's say try to kill the enemy as long as you're going to kill it it's going to be faster for you and that's how you're going to be able to get all all the rewards now you're going to need to upgrade the box unfortunately the box will require you to upgrade some uh, upgrade the door over here so you're going to need to have a specific door in order for you to be able to upgrade your box but also you're going to need to have a specific amount of gold coins if you're going to have those gold coins you're going to be able to upgrade the box if you're going to upgrade the box you're going to get more gold coins if you're going to get the gold coins you're going to be able to get the table machine that's really important because from the table machines you're going to get pills with the pills you're going to be able to get vitamin solutions vitamin solutions will offer you gold coins so keep that in mind those are going to be quite quite useful for you upgrade the door and also as i mentioned upgrade the spoon tables over here but important important over here if you're going to get enough pills you're going to be able to upgrade different kind of special things over here don't forget about these things the toolbox is really important because it will automatically repair the door with one percent for each second now really important skills over here for the door you're going to have the emergency bell some of the maps over here are going to be quite hard so you're going to need to consume that but besides that you're going to be able to repair the door uh, if you're going to see that you're going to have a strong strong enemy over there that will require you to repair it unfortunately as i mentioned not so many active players in this part probably you have played similar games it's not going to be that hard just farm as fast as you can if you see that you're not going to be able to move to the next zone what you're going to need to do you're going to need to farm the previous map in order for you to get enough of the resources in order for you to upgrade the main character or upgrade different kind of other things in the laboratory i'm going to show you afterwards probably you have played similar things so as i mentioned as long as you're going to survive for those six minutes or you're going to uh, kill all the enemies it's going to be a victory now important important if you're not going to have a room with two players what you're going to want to do you're going to want to stay as close as you can to uh, other player the important thing is for you to collaborate with other players in order for you to kill them in order for you to make them run away from the door that's really important either you will survive those six minutes either you will kill those guys but you're going to need to collaborate with other players because if you're going to collaborate that's how you're going to be able to uh, move to the next campaign mode and so on all right now i'm going to exit over here i'm not going to keep you that long because it's the same same idea you're going to get a lot a lot of those green uh balls and with those things you're going to be able to upgrade over here the door hp afterwards you're going to be able to upgrade the tower attack and the tower attack speed those are going to be really important for you to have because you're going to use them in order for you to have more and more damage now besides that you're going to have the character over here and besides the character you're going to have the shop 
Besides that, you're going to have some cards. Now, the cards, if you're going to get the cards, you're going to get them by going over here in the first aid kit. And if you do have enough keys, you're going to unlock different kind of chests. From those chests, you're going to be able to get some cards. And with those cards, you're going to be able to have extra, extra skills in the main game. Keep in mind, you're going to have five tickets daily. Try to use them. Try to play over here. Unfortunately, I have tried to play in the multiplayer, but there are not so many active players. So in the campaign mode, you're just going to be on your own. But in the multiplayer over here, let's hope that they will do some improvements and they will attract more and more active players you will be able to fight with other players so keep in mind stay as close as you can to other players in order for you to kill those guys that are after you in order for you to be able to go forward and forward that's it it's not going to be that hard probably have played in our games but that's going to be the trick stay as close as you can and try to do the upgrades properly as fast as you can until next time be safe bye